Hi, my name is Stephen Martelli and welcome to freedomeducation.ca. So yesterday I posted a video for you guys that was on how to follow through with your goals. And you know, when I post my videos and I write my articles, what I find is that right at the very end, that's when I get the most ideas for the next start on the next video. And so this nugget came up and I thought I'd share it with you guys. One more way to follow through with your goals is to, to put some skin in the game, to really leverage yourself and look for something that's going to stretch and get out of your comfort zone. And let me explain with an example. So what I did was when I left my job, um, I had sort of a little bit of bank money aside that would you know settle me and keep us going for a few months. But I didn't have the consistent income coming in from the, the business that I would have liked to have had. And I think that's a misconception with some people. They think that all that you know everything's perfect when they leave their job. That business is bringing in money and they just leave and it's perfect. And for some people that might be the case. For me, it wasn't. I just basically jumped in and I had a plan and I just went with the plan. And what I found was that in the first three or four months when I was working full time and I left my job, I had actually produced more results and gotten. Uh, just a lot more further in that four months than I had in probably the past year and a half working on the business part-time. So what I did is I really, some people would say it's a risk, but it was a calculated risk because I did have a plan. And so I took a risk and I went for it and I jumped in. I put some skin in the game. And that term, I got that term from Bill Bartman because he said that when he was uh, moving his company from a $5 million company to something like a $500 million company, because the guy's a billionaire, what he had done is he had bought and he had a plane and the plane was like a two million dollar plane but he wanted the pimped up like you know really super like Cadillac version plane and this plane was like a fifty million dollar plane more than he could afford but he went out and he bought it then he went to all the employees in the company and said guys I bought this plane and uh, it's for company use and it's got like a kitchen and you know it's got like a whole suite and he said, the reason I bought it is because the only way we can afford this plane is if we become a $500 million company. And he goes, I'm giving us five years to do it. And they set a goal to do it and they ended up doing it. And he, that's what he terms putting skin in the game is really putting yourself out there, putting yourself at risk so you can challenge yourself and go to the next level. And so another really, one, really great way to do that is uh, a mastermind group that I'm part of. Basically, it's a group of people. There's five of us. We get together and we talk about our goals and we... We're accountable to each other. And one thing that I found really helpful is there was one, one person in the group, I won't name any names, but one person in the group that was having trouble launching the website. And uh, they, they'd set a date to have the website launched by June 1st. It didn't get launched. Not a big deal, but we, what someone said is they came up with a creative idea and said, okay, why don't we do this? Set a new date for your launch of your website. And if you don't meet that launch, as long as you agree, we everyone agrees to that launch, and especially the person who's committing to it, if they agree to that date, if you don't make that launch, what you have to do is pay everyone in the group $25. Okay, so that's $100. And so that sort of, that, what it does is it puts some skin in the game because now there's something at stake. And it was a great idea and it ended up working really well. So I think one thing for sure is that when you were taking goals and you're taking action is to put some skin in the game. Put something out there that's something you haven't done before and really, you know, just put yourself out there. And it, that will help you build uh, ultimately what uh, what really comes down to is you want to build the habit of completing everything you start. So this is just kind of like a strategy or a way to do that is to get yourself in the habit of completing everything you start. So I hope you enjoyed that tip and you enjoyed today's video. Thank you for watching and listening. My name is Stephen Martile and we'll talk to you soon.